If it's in your newsfeed, it's in the feed with Amy and Sean. 1027 VGS. So remember when you couldn't buy a car at all? Just tough. Mm -hmm. Can't and find them. A lot of people buying cars are probably were way overvalued. Mm -hmm. um, and now a lot of people can't afford to pay their loans. So a lot of people are getting repoed. Ford has thought of this and said, you know what? Well, maybe we should put in a patent. So they did, and it was just published last week. The automaker, a solution for bills that aren't getting paid. Mm -hmm. It could result in, you know, a little warning on your screen and your car saying, hey, um, you know, you owe a payment. <laughs> That's little... embarrassing. You imagine picking up a girl and being like, hey, it's like you haven't paid your bill. Oh, I told it's like a software error. I don't know. And then all <laughs> of a sudden you get the alert on your phone. But ding, hey, mm -hmm. you owe us a payment. And then you ignore that one. And all of a sudden you have, you know, the girl come back in and the radio doesn't work because they've taken away parts of the car or your, <laughs> or, or your windows won't go down. They could do all of this. Uh, you could They could lock you out of the car. Or maybe only on weekends and then weekdays. Say, so here, we'll let you use the car, drive to work and back <laughs> yeah. and pay us. Wow. They can even put a little beeping alarm inside where it's like, you know, you're there and like just like that one uh, battery that's missing in the fire alarm in your house, just like every 10 seconds, beep, mm -hmm. just annoy the yeah, heck yeah, out yeah. of you until you pay them. And the last case, if they lock you out and you have an emergency, they will allow the car to autonomously drive you to the nearest hospital. Oh, my God. God. <laughs> this is all in the patent. No word is whether or not they're going to do it, but that's really draconian. Wow. Uh, man, TikTok uh, just announced today they're going to roll out a new feature. It's a one-hour daily screen time limit, quote-unquote, for all users under 18 in the coming weeks. Users will have to enter a passcode to extend the time and... You know, the kids can enter their own passcode. Easy. Under 13, a parent or guardian can set a passcode and give them an additional 30 minutes on good behavior. But, like, I'm I'm keeping my kids, like, I'm trying to give them a, like, early 90s, like, some kind of early 90s life. Mm -hmm. Just they remember not being on a device all day. Yeah. It's tough. Yeah, it is really, really hard. It. I don't know. I, I think I, I like what they're trying, but... I don't think it's going to work. I really don't. If they want to watch Maybe it. Maybe for some, but wanna, not for my kids. want to watch a movie. If it's like 12, 2.42, I'll start the, the movie 12 minutes in. Be like, nope, HBO started at 2.30. <laughs> yeah. You, you have to suffer. Well, how does this start? I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> suffer like the rest of us. Mm -hmm. Finally, we go to Nebraska where a cheerleader found herself in a predicament. The cheer squad at Morrill High School was supposed to compete in the state championship. Only one problem. Uh, the rest of her team quit. <laughs> they didn't want to be there She's anymore. all alone. Yeah, so she... Uh, was given the opportunity to perform alone at the tournament. Uh, Katrina Kohel is her name. She is a senior and she's like, you know what? Fine. I'll do it by myself. Let's see how this goes. Here we go. Just a little smidge. <laughs> That's so cool. Good so, for her. It's her senior year, you know. You know, live a little. Yeah, I love that. Her voice cracks, though. It's tough when yeah. you don't have the rest of the choir with you. Yeah. <laughs> You're singing all alone. Yeah, <laughs> right. it's pretty tough. She got a solo, all right? But hey, she finished eighth out of 12. Wow. <laughs> other groups, the uh, 9, 10, 11, 12, just your program should be shut down. <laughs> exactly. You got beat by that one girl. <laughs> Beautiful thing, though, and uh, congratulations to her. Yeah, that's go. great.